Manchester United captain Bruno Fernandes is demanding more from himself, especially in front of goals. And the skipper could do with finding the net for the first time this season soon as under fire Eric Ten Hag has been given a stay of execution as head coach. Yet the next four games, against opponents United should be confident of beating, have been earmarked as make or break for the Dutchman who is unlikely to survive the next international break without a significant improvement in results and performances. But as the international break reaches its midway point, the Old Trafford boss must also contend with a lengthy injury list that is particularly hitting his defence hard. Here are the big tales from around Manchester United over the past 24 hours. Bruno Fernandes has revealed his desperation to get off the mark this season and end his goal drought for Manchester United. United skipper Fernandes has failed to score in 10 appearances for his club this season, although he netted for Portugal in a 2,1 win over Scotland last month. Fernandes has struck the crossbar twice this season, during United's goalless draws at Crystal Palace and Aston Villa, and admitted he must take responsibility for his failure to score. His next goal will be his 80th for United in all competitions, a number only five of the club's overseas players, Eric Cantona, Anthony Marshall, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, Cristiano Ronaldo and Ruud van Nistelrooy, reached. But Fernandez is demanding better from himself. Eric Ten Hag may have been granted a stay of execution at Manchester United but their four games after the international break will be make or break for the Dutchman. And United, despite their dismal start to the campaign, have been dealt a favourable run of fixtures to convince United Chiefs he remains the right man for the job. United have taken just eight points from their first seven league games and only newly promoted Southampton have scored fewer goals. A board meeting at Ineos headquarters in London on Tuesday failed to yield a conclusive decision around Ten Hag's future. But he is still in the last chance saloon. After the international break United returned to action with a home fixture against Brentford and the three matches after that will decide his future. But Ten Hag is already facing a selection crisis that includes five defenders. Fullbacks Luke Shaw and Tyrell Malaysia remain long-term absentees while Lenny Yoro is still some way from making his competitive debut after breaking a foot in pre-season, although the France youngster is back training. Harry Maguire confirmed earlier this week that he is set for several weeks on the sidelines after being injured away to Aston Villa last weekend, while Nasser Mazrui is the latest to join the absentee list after undergoing a minor surgical procedure on his heart earlier this week. And there are four more who are doubts for the bees and receive your daily dose of Mirror Football content. We also treat our community members to special offers, promotions, and adverts from us and our partners. If you don't like our community, you can check out any time you like. If you're curious, you can read our